Well, the morning we're starting off with winds uh, not in excess of 20 miles an hour. In fact, it's pretty mild, and that's going to be our day today. That's why I show you this. We're not going to have the winds we had yesterday. Cloud showers, east winds 5 to 10 miles an hour, so it'll be calmer. It will be a little warmer, 60, and we'll see cloud cover with isolated showers. We'll see showers overnight, potentially down to 41 degrees, and so that is the expectation. Now, we look at the satellite radar, you can see it's relatively dry in eastern Washington and north Idaho. It'll stay that way until maybe tonight when we see a few showers coming across. Uh, right now, uh, these models showing, you know, about 5 o'clock, we could see some scattered showers coming through. Um, more numerous for Saturday. And, of course, we're going to see heavier amounts in the central panhandle of Idaho, pushing into Montana. More snow for Lookout Pass. Schweitzer could be a big winner um, on Saturday into Sunday, picking up several inches of snow for skiing. Um, we're going to see some. Then we're going to see things turn a little bit for Sunday morning, and we could see that chance. So we are expecting, again, highs today hovering around 60, cooler north, uh, Bonners Ferry, Sandpoint, about 52 degrees. South, it's going to be a little warmer, getting in some of that flow. So near 70 for the Tri-Cities into Lewiston. We're going to have 63, 64, uh, Ritzville, Moses Lake. Um, really not a bad day today and again, not as wet as we had expected. When we look at the wet weather days, Saturday certainly seems to be one of the bigger days. We see scattered showers and the potential for some morning early light snow for Sunday, Monday. And then Wednesday, um, this system starts to kick and we'll get a, a big... Um, hit there where we'll see more sustained rain on Wednesday with scattered showers on Thursday and we start to dry out for the weekend. So really we're going to cool to 49 on Saturday, mid 40s Sunday and then back to about average for Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. Again with that wettest day looking to be Wednesday with scattered showers in between.